Welcome to Culture Night. My name is Dr Anna Clark. I'm a Fellow of the Faculty of Public Health and Medicine here at the College of Physicians of Ireland and you're all very welcome. In this era of COVID-19 when we're scientists throughout the world are looking for vaccination against this COVID and trying to develop a vaccination against the COVID-19, I want to talk about infectious diseases and vaccination and the history of vaccination in Ireland. Uh, the first vaccination happened in Ireland in 1800. It was against smallpox which was a deadly infectious disease, which had been recorded since uh, the 3rd century BC and it spread throughout the world. Now, vaccination uptake was slow, it was new. Um, vaccination laws were introduced in 1840. Uh, it gave the responsibility of vaccination to the poor law guardians, but that was associated with workhouses and there was a stigma associated with that. So following the famine, it was moved to dispensaries and doctors working in the dispensaries. And so vaccination continued, as I said, by the end of the century, 85% of children were vaccinated against smallpox. And the impact of that was seen because from 1871 to 1880, there were about 7,500 deaths of smallpox in Ireland. Whereas by 1901 to 1910, there were only 65 recorded. So the impact was seen. In the following years, in the new century, efforts were made to improve the smallpox vaccination that was being used, but also to, to develop other vaccines. And so vaccines against other infectious diseases came on stream against diphtheria, tetanus, polio, cholera. Following a worldwide campaign by the WHO in the 50s and 60s, smallpox was eradicated worldwide in 1979. Now the college have always been an advocate for vaccination and more recently they were part of the Vaccine Alliance which worked hard to try and improve the vaccine uptake for HPV vaccine. However, in 1910, they also issued a statement promoting the use of smallpox vaccine. And I'll just read you a line. They promoted it because it was a preventive measure which would rid the native land from one of the most terrible plagues which has ever afflicted the human race. Uh, we are in an era of COVID-19 uh, where scientists worldwide are attempting to develop a vaccine against COVID-19. In the meantime, there is a preventive measure that you can take to prevent influenza this year, which it may also help in the fight against COVID-19. So if you're in a high risk group, if you're a healthcare worker, if you're 65 or older, if you're a parent of a child who's age two to 12, uh, if you're in a nursing home or vulnerable or have a high risk condition, all these risk groups are available to look at uh, on uh, the National Immunisation website, www.immunisation.ie. This vaccine will be free of charge from your general practitioner or from pharmacy, and I would urge you all to consider getting it.